shit. Wow. That's fucking money, you know? rich for way. Look, hey, came up with some bands. bands. Boom in a sweater. Yeah, chewy the pants. He did it again. Woo. Then I did it again. Then, then I boy shit it again. Drinking again. Yeah. That boy jigging again. Then he just hit another lick. Damn. Yeah. Then he just run up with your shit. Damn. Yeah. Then he just pull up in a whip. Yeah. Damn. Then he just fuck another bitch. Yeah. yeah. And she just did it on their tricks. Yeah. Damn. Hey YouTubers, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Janelle. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Before we get started with this video, I just want to say thank you to all my subscribers who have stayed with me all this time. I know I haven't been very consistent. I've been putting out a few videos a month, but I will be graduating from college with my bachelor's degree this Friday. Finally free after 16 years of slavery, y'all. It's finally over, almost, unless I go to grad school, then it's not over, <laughs> but almost there. Yeah, with that being said, I will be here a lot more consistently. Um, I still don't have my own camera yet, but I will be working on getting my own camera, the lighting and things like that, just a lot of new things to make my channel better for y'all, better for you guys. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'll be seeing, you guys will be seeing a lot more of me after this Friday. Today I want to talk to you guys about my new wig. Yes, I made my first wig ever, you guys. Um, well, it's actually not really my first wig. I had a synthetic wig a couple months ago just to kind of try the wig life out, see if I liked it or not. And I did. So I decided I was going to go ahead and make the jump and get human hair bundles. Um, I considered having someone else make the wig for me, but then I was like, nah bank account was kind of crying and I was like I might just try this out myself so I watched a whole bunch of wig making videos and tips and things like that I got all the materials together and I went to work and it was difficult I didn't record it because it was my first time I don't know what I was doing and I don't want to teach you guys anything and I'm learning myself so yeah I didn't record it but I'll be making more because I'm really enjoying not having to do my own hair right now um, so I will be making more wigs so maybe in the future I'll record one for you guys but there's tons of videos out there girls who can do it and make magic with these bundles so you don't even need me so this hair is Eunice 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 hair um, however you pronounce that it's the Peruvian body wave in 18 inch 20 and 22 inch bundles with a 16 inch closure. I took about I want to say roughly four days to make this wig like so like the majority the bulk part like sewing on the tracks took a few hours I'm not really sure how long I don't know how much time is going by I didn't have a clock but um, it took me a few hours to get everything together and then after I first got all the hair onto the cap um, I was just kind of picking at it day after day, just plucking at the roots, just trying to make sure that it looked good, just trying to secure the track some more, put in some clips, like, you know, for extra security. So it took me about four days before I was, like, actually satisfied. And even now, like, today, I was still plucking in the middle just to make sure that it looked really natural. For the hair itself, I am in love. I don't have much experience with human hair. I've only ever had a sew-in before and it was with Malaysian body wave bundles. I had a good experience with that um, hair as well, but this hair, like, there's no shedding. Like, I don't know, this hair is just really, it's so soft. Like, I love it, how it feels. It feels so natural. The color was so natural. I love the wave. It's super easy to straighten. I mean, it looks really nice when it's straightened too. I've had this hair for about a week now. I got it last Tuesday and it's, I got it last, no, I got it, I have, I've had this for about two weeks now, I think, actually. Yeah, and I have to say that I love it. There is a, a little bit of shedding because I did cut the wefts and I didn't put weft glue on it but I'm gonna get there we're gonna get there but it's still a not a lot of shedding so even with the wefts being cut um, fold over method just was not working out for me y'all if you make wigs you know what I'm talking about <laughs> oh I really like this hair um, when I got it there was no like weird smell I know people say that their hair smells really weird weird when they get it sometimes but this hair didn't have a smell it smelled like 
weave but it wasn't like bad like once i shampooed and conditioned it it didn't smell like weave anymore it just smelled like hair that being said how i've been taking care of it for the past two weeks i've been washing it with my maui moisture coconut milk shampoo just because it's a cheap shampoo and i didn't really like it too much for my hair um the more i used it the more i realized that it wasn't really working too well but it does wonders on this hair let me tell you now i've also washed it with um this giovanni tea tree triple treat invigorating tea tree triple treat invigorating shampoo um yeah with that which i use for my natural hair and i love i just love that shampoo um it's great it's amazing and i condition with this lovely thing right here i love this for my hair type and for this hair it just smells so good and it makes my hair so soft and this hair so soft it's great and then i'll finish it off with a little bit of moroccan oil yeah it makes it like nice and gives it like a nice luster and controls the frizz a little bit um this hair's not that frizzy but it can it's it wisps in the wind a little bit you know so it just kind of controls that a little bit but yeah i just really wanted to show you guys my first wig ever i'm just so excited about it i think i did a pretty good job if you can see the closure i think i did a pretty good job with like plucking it and making it look natural the closure itself lays really flat shout out to Eunice hair this hair is bomb the closure is bomb next i'm gonna try a frontal and maybe some curly hair you know i'm gonna dabble in this bundle life a little bit more because it's super convenient it's expensive but it's convenient um speaking of price the price of this hair that i paid i paid about 150 dollars for all three bundles and the closure so compared to other brands <laughs> of hair this was really cheap like so it's really affordable really good quality hair i think you know taking into consideration the fact that i don't have much can uh don't have much experience with too many other weaves but uh, from what i do know and from what i've heard because i did all my all the research in the world <laughs> on hair before like on all different types of hair before i decided on this one based on what the reviews like the reviews that i saw i have like nobody's been lying like they're all telling the truth like this hair is amazing <laughs> and because i've seen a lot of reviews on Eunice hair and a lot of good things about their hair so i decided why not try it out and it works out really well i'll come back and do like um maybe a one month update or two month update on this hair for you guys first impression i'm in love but you know after a while it might not be the same thing it may be we're gonna see <laughs> we're gonna see how long we can hold on to this hair for um i'm shooting to see if i can keep this wig for a year because i'm not gonna wear it all the time i'm still gonna wear my hair out you know this is just for like when i feel like my hair needs a break or special occasions or whatever when i just feel like looking bad and bougie you know <laughs> but yeah so that's all i wanted to talk to you guys about today um i hope you guys enjoy this video thanks so much for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe share this with your friends you know all of that good stuff i'll see you guys in my next video bye